and down trees in the middle of the freeway and drivers spinning out on the roads. That's what our crews witnessed in Placer County this morning. KCRA 3's Brittany Johnson spoke with drivers who were stuck in all that mess. It's the same story out here in Colfax, the steady snowfall creating a mess for drivers. This patch of snow, a real challenge for people Monday morning. Driver after driver after driver, even first responders. It's the same story out here in Colfax, the steady snowfall creating a mess for drivers. This patch of snow, a real challenge for people Monday morning. Driver after driver after driver, even first responders getting stuck in the exact same spot. People with four wheel drive also struggled to navigate through the ruts. Yeah, we didn't have the chains. We slid out. I need a ride now. Drivers also feeling pain at the pump. Not because of the gas prices, rather, they couldn't even get gas. This 76 gas station having problems with its pumps. I, I got a half a tank, but I was expecting to get gas. Whether trying to get home or travel through the area, people were left to figure out their next move after getting stuck here due to steady snowfall in the area. I was trying to go to work. I can't even get home. I've been here for a couple of days. And I live up the hill about 12 miles from here and it's buried. I got here yesterday. Just been stuck, uh, went through every possible route, but no luck, so gotta, gotta stick it out. The snow even put a wrench in vacation plans. We had a vacation planned through Nevada, Utah, Wyoming, Montana, Idaho, Washington, and we made it, oh, four hours from home. It took us nine hours to kind of go around trip to get to this point. Wendy and her husband have no choice but to stay at a nearby hotel until conditions clear up. Got the last hotel room in town. <laughs> that hotel, owned by Raj Singh, who tells me all 70 rooms are booked and there's no power. I had to run to the Home Depot this morning, bring some emergency lights and put it in the hallway so the people can just walk. During our drive out to Placer County, we also saw down trees along I-80. Some of them even landed in the middle of the freeway. We also saw road closures and a few backups. Reporting in Placer County, Brittany Johnson, KCRA 3 News.